Shalom, Yashorella. Before I begin, I want to start off by giving all praise on you and to Yahweh. By Hashem Yahushai, by Hashem Rukakudash. The honor to the elders on the Apostle Great Millstone. Peace and hesitation unto the elect. <clears throat> you know, the Spirit was on me today to, um, you know, hop on his lesson real quick, man. <clears throat> uh, I just I just got off the phone with a brother. You know, the brother you call, man. I was, you know, <clears throat> it's always very uplifting to hear from that brother, you know. It's always very uplifting to, to, to understand and know that you, you're you not alone in this truth, man. You know, you're not alone, man. And 20, 20 Akim out there who <clears throat> who would prefer your solitude, you know, it's time to step up out of that comfort zone, man. Because I know personally I was like that too, you know. I wouldn't, I would just stick to myself, you know. I wouldn't. I wouldn't call nobody, I wouldn't, <clears throat> you know, I wouldn't talk to no brother in this truth, you know, I, I, I would stick to myself, and, and that's very bad in this truth, man, because, you know, the Lord wants you to talk, <clears throat> the Lord wants you to talk to, to your brothers, man, the Lord wants you to be close to your brothers, man, because, you know, you gotta look up, you gotta look after one another, man, you know, you gotta ask how you, how the day been, how, what's going on you know if they good in the spirit you know and these are all questions that i never had before <sighs> like it's cold <clears throat> but these are all questions that i've never had before you know and and you know the brother makes sure that i'm, that I'm good you know the brother makes sure that, I, that i'm safe you know and i appreciate that you know the water how about me always have for you know <clears throat> bless me from some for some brothers man because you know it's it's a lot tougher to be in this truth if you're by yourself, man. You know it's a lot it's a lot tougher, man. Cause you feel you feel alone. You you feel you you like you don't you know you like you got nobody to talk to. Like if you think that you 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 going through something alone, which is not the case, man. You know <sighs> you know it's it's not the case, man. You know. A lot of brothers are going through some shit, man. A lot of brothers are going through some shit, and that's why it's always, it's always good to have someone to look after you, you know. Like in the picture, you know, you, you see all those, you know, you see a depiction of all those brothers out there, you know. That they're all like, you know, they're all, you know, that that's something beautiful, man. That's something to look forward to in the kingdom, man. You know, wearing your beautiful garments, you know, telling stories to one another about. You know, how we was doing this, how we was doing that. Remember that time we was preaching and that dumbass crack that came up to us, you know. <laughs> you know, it's, it's always beautiful, man. And, you know, Lord willing, I get to visit those brothers one day. You know, Lord willing. But, you know, enough rambling. This is John 13 and 35. But this shall all men know that ye are my disciples if you have love <clears throat> one to another right and this is a red letter so how should i said this you know <clears throat> i made a lesson no not too long ago about about brothers having to stop you know um having to stop have this this vendetta against another brother you know you know if you have something against another brother sort it out man you know, because you don't want to be alone in this truth, man. I'm telling you personally, you know, the Lord got me. The Lord had me do that for a little bit. And then he put me into a better spot, man. So to why help me all shy, man. Because when you're alone in this truth, man, you know, it's hard. You know, you ain't got nobody to humble you down. You ain't got nobody to, 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 to be by your side, man. You know, that's why this brotherhood is very precious. You know, that's why. That's why um <clears throat> that's why you always see the Akim out there posted up with the Akim, you know. You know, um taking pictures, you know. And that's a beautiful thing to see, man. You always wanna have memories, you know. It's a beautiful thing, man. Very beautiful thing. You know. Romans twelve verse ten. Be kindly afflicted one to another with brotherly love and honor preferring one another 
Right, man. You know? <clears throat> Wait, actually, let me go to, um, let me go to John again. Let me go to John 13 again. And let me go back a verse. So this is John 13 and 34. A new commandment I give unto you. So this is a commandment. Which means if you're not doing this, you're going off. If you're not doing what I'm about to read, you're going off. That ye love one another as I have loved you. That ye also love one another. You know, so if you're not, if you know, if, if you want to be alone, you, you're not showing love to a brother, man. You know, you want to be alone, you want to be, you want to be, you know. What is that? What do you think the brothers are going to be like? What do you think the brothers are going to say to you? You know, what do you think the brothers are going to be thinking, man? Oh, that brother don't want to hang out with me. You know, that's, that's going to make him feel some type of way, you know, because, you know, the brother wants to, they want to get to know you better, you know. They want to get to know, you know, what your story, you know. They want to get to know how you've been, you know. And you pushing them away isn't doing anybody any favors, especially yourself, man. Because <clears throat> now what? By you pushing yourself away, you... Not only are you going off, you know, but you have nobody, you have nobody to talk to. You have nobody to, 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 you know, be by your side. You have nobody to, <clears throat> you have nobody to, 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 to push you forward. And ultimately, you know, we know the Lord, you know, he controls all things. <clears throat> but. That's a lot here, but, you know. It's just, it's a lot better if you have brothers in this truth, man. You know, you don't want to be a lone wolf, man. You do not want to be a lone wolf. As a matter of fact, I, um, I'm going to post a video at the end of, of this, um, of this video, of this, like, lesson. But, um, <clears throat> ignore the, uh, the financial part, you know, just think about it as a spiritually fine. Think about it as a spiritually bank, you know, because <clears throat> you, you can't do shit by yourself, man, you know, you can't do anything by yourself, man, you know, um, there's, there's a saying, two minds work better than one, you know, and we're all one body, you know, think about how your body works, man, your brain is telling, you know, each body part communicates with one another, you know? If we are truly, if you truly believe yourself to be a disciple of Yahweh, you have to think about that, man. You know? Even if you, you know, <laughs> even if you bite, even if you, um, bite your nail a little too low, that shit's gonna burn, you know? That, that, that your nail is telling, you know, your, your body that this is hurting, you know? If you stub your toe, your toe is telling you, you know, your body, it just hurts, you know. When you eat, when you eat junk food and you start throwing up, you know, that's your body telling you, I don't want this in me, take it out. You know. So, if if the body can't communicate, if you're not communicating with the rest of the body, then you just destroying the body as a whole. Imagine if, imagine if, if. Imagine if you got got stabbed or something, you know, and your brain ain't and in your and let's say you got stabbed in your forearm and your forearm ain't telling your brain, you know, hey man, you know, it's hurting. You're not gonna know. You're not gonna know you got stabbed. You know, and and, and what you just gonna be like, oh, your, your forearms just be like, oh, I can handle it, you know, because <clears throat> you know some brothers are, you know, some brothers are tough mentally, man, but. You know, the Lord is gonna, you know, we we gonna we're gonna go through some shit, man. And you know, it's it's gonna be tough. And the only thing we have in this truth, you know, obviously Yahweh bless me outside, but there's brotherhood, man. There's brotherhood. So you know, hold it tight, hold it, you know, hold it carefully, man. Hold hold it hold it dearly, man, because you know, you ought to be grateful, man. Not not every brother has the privilege of to. To see another brother, you know, in person, man. 
you know, not everybody, you know, not everybody has that privilege, man. So, you know, if you have that privilege, man, I'll praise to you. I'll you outside, man. You know? But, you know, with that, I'm going to play the clip. <clears throat> the Wadi Ha'u Bashim Yashai for giving me the spirit to do this lesson. I'll praise to you. Ha'u Bashim Yashai. Shalom. The whole idea of this lone soldier, this Rambo, I'll do it all by myself. That's all dead, bro. You need to have a team. It's player versus player. And for the same reason, if you were out here on the street and you want to defend yourself, you want your boys around you. It's the same thing with trying to get rich. Problem is, is trying to find is trying to find guys on your level. That's the hard part, right?